Hey guys, so today I'm making some soup. Now I bought a parcel, a parcel of cow foot, cow cod. All of this is the cod, aka the cow's penis. All of this. So we're eating cow's penis today. I'm a soup bone. So I'm going to wash all of this. So, Braden is in the background. Most as usual. So I'm going to wash all of this and put it to pressure. Mm. Welcome to my channel. Guys, we didn't have shown this. The cow here, though. It's the same. You want a pedicure. Well, if you know you're going to bed tomorrow, right? I know. Um, set up yourself. Like, look at that. Scrape it off. Here, here, dirty stuff. Toad, it one clean, man. So, for all the cows out there, do your pedicure when you know they're slaughtered, dear man. Come on, man. You know, look good. I bet this was a man cow. Cause if it was a girl, she'd have known that she would go and get her little, you know, pedicure and get her um thingy polish. It's a man cow, man. Who oh, no. know? You take care on yourself, man. Still, I got eat it, though, sir. Alrighty, guys. So I've washed, clean up my cod and um everything i cleaned everything i give the sir there a pedicure put on some gel polish on him and think one new one there's a new gel polish we put on it one of them you know one new one we put on on him and so so i don't like me turn him into a girl or anything okay um so i've washed everybody Use vinegar wash them up whenever i'm not lying so i just use vinegar and wash them up and so so now I'm gonna add a little bit of seed, just a few, and then now I'm gonna um put some water in it, and I'm also going to I think I'm gonna pressure it with um with pumpkin. So yeah, I'm gonna cut a pumpkin. I'm putting there. I'm loving time my pumpkin with her, you know, that you can get that color there, that pretty pretty color there. So about half an hour I'm gonna put this to the pressure for. Alrighty, so I've um, cut my pumpkin, I've left the the skin on. So I'm just cut it up small like that. That's you can pressure out and stuff. Guys, I don't want to show no my cut but I guess everybody knows how to cut a pumpkin, right? <laughs> we took out the inside and we wash it of course and then we peel it we, we, we cut it up we're leaving the skin on i just like to leave the skin on i guess extra nutrients i don't know but um okay guys so put it on now I guess what i put some pimento seeds in there i put a couple cloves of garlic and may actually drop some salt in other pot as well so um, what I normally do, I make it kind of get hot first and then no I'm going to put on the pressure cooker cover. So I'm going to cover it with another pot cover and then when it's a uh, bubble up and thing, then I put on the pressure cooker and then I'm going to time it for about 30 minutes. Hopefully by then it, have, it would have tenderized and then I can, you know, start up my soup. One thing I think the soup, I want some corn, you know, but I don't have no corn. So, homegirl is up to work with it. Um, guys, as I was, I think I was saying earlier that um, because I'm doing, I'm videoing myself, I'm gonna have a proper tripod. Um, I'm unable to like show everything that's happening because I have noticed all of my cook videos. Then when I, because I have the phone in my hand and doing what I'm doing, then sometimes I have the phone down to another part and it just looks so weird. So. I am um, just doing when I can um, hold the camera myself. So um, I guess let's get started then. So 
um, yes, see my pumpkin then my short and so so I'm gonna start my soup now. I'll type of something something. I hate these things when you get out of the soup, you see, when you the meat them. So see everything is nice and tenderized, guys. I love them bone here. Them bone here. Get to suck them out. Look at look it, look it, look it, look it. I love these. So Alright, okay. Go we'll change the pot. And then um we get the ball of rolling as we said now the corner the only thing that's missing, but um it's still like a nice rock and I do it. Alrighty guys, so for those who know me know that me like when my soup does light. So honestly all I'm gonna put in there is some cho cho. We just need flour. <laughs> so cho cho cutting cubes or whatever uh, some of them are triangle whatever that's not important small cuts of cucumber carrots and some more um pumpkin and dumplings these are like dime size dumplings but some like me dumpling them in a soup small so that's what i'm gonna probably drop one edge in there as well so that's what i'll be doing and as usual Brayden is doing the most a trouble something in my school's a trouble but anywho this is about my cooking today i'm breathing bloody so um i'm going to throw these in the pot now i've already put a pack of cock soup in there so we're going to do that now Alrighty, guys so new update i've just placed everything in the pot don't put in the pot Everybody in there, them little black thing there you see is hot pepper flakes I put in there coming out my whole pepper at this time. So um Alright, so I've put everything in there. These black things that you see as I said is um, hot pepper flakes. I've put everything in there. So now I'm just going to allow this now to come to a boil skeleton time and thing. Come to a boil and do its thing. Alright, so Stay tuned guys, so I guess the next time you see me, I'll show you what it looks like done and then show you what it looks like plated. Alrighty. See the bubble up already? Alrighty guys, I know you haven't seen me all day, but um, I'm about to share my food, but before I do, you know that rocks and bottles of something drinking, right? So, today, I'm going to try and see if I have a video myself. Mama, look. <laughs> the craziness over here. I have a screwdriver of vodka, ice, a nice glass, cherries. I now have my orange for garnish. So, it's been a long day and I'm having a drink. Don't say as usual in the comments, please. Thank you. I appreciate it. So well, let's see what's in the pot, right? Alrighty. So here we go. Um. Dumplings. Alrighty guys, I didn't do anything special with my plate. All I did was um, portion them. It's not as thick as I would want it, but um, honestly, it really does taste good. The flavor do come together. I seasoned it nicely. I put some hot pepper flakes in there because as I said, I did not have any um, real pepper, fresh pepper. So um, I used my hot pepper flakes as usual. So um that's it guys from me thank you so much for joining me all of them bone they want to see in this lag i can go suck them out yes so um thanks for um watching my videos guys please share comment subscribe if you haven't already and please have yourself a wonderful day a wonderful night and love yourself and just be safe out there corona time i want it to end so cheers I'm having soup and a cocktail.
love you guys bye